closer. Let's start with Adam Dunn. You tweeted about this yesterday. He looks better, but that's not saying much, is it? Uh, two things. He has lost weight, which I think was critical. He's in much better condition, and his swing is shorter. I saw, you know, when, when he played in Arizona, I saw a very patient hitter, a guy that could take a base on balls, a guy that you really had to throw strikes to for him to swing. That's what I saw yesterday. It, it's impressive how hard he's working. I am um, bringing him up on my draft list now because I like, I like Adam Dunn as a hitter. I always have. On your show, Butch, last year, I said he would hit 50 home runs. Yes, you did. And that's what he should have hit. That's what he should have hit at that ballpark. Well, he He's not going to ever hit 50 but Bernie, again. You, you, as a scout, you talk about the shorter swing. You talk about this. And it is spring training. He did change leagues. He had all kinds of problems. The thing that stuck out to me, tell me if I'm wrong, guys were pitching to him. The same Adam Dunn who made them pay in the National League, and by the way, had a selective enough eye to walk enough to offset all the strikeouts that he had from a fantasy perspective. They were challenging him right from the get-go, and he wasn't even catching up with the pitches last year. I think he was heavier. I think he was out of shape. I really do. I, I, I'm not saying he's going to come all the way back, but I think he's going to hit 20 home runs, and I think he's going to hit all the way up to 220, maybe 225. But he's not a guy I really want uh, on my club because of the variable, because he could go either way. He could skyrocket, or he could be right back into the dumper. I don't know. I just like what I saw, and I'm, I'm proud of him for, as, as a person, for saying, you know, no excuses. I've got to turn this around. He's going to play some at first base. Let's wait and see. My jury is out, but he looks better.